Oh, it's the circle. I just love this. And I love this opening tune. Pump up the jam. Come on, Michelle. What have we got? Hi folks, Gord Camp here and today I'm so excited because as some of you know, I have been asked a quite a few times now to do a reaction video. So because I'm a massive fan of the circle, especially USA, I decided to start doing a reaction video for this season. So I don't know what else to say about that. If you've watched The Circle, basically imagine social media during COVID when you're home alone. When you're in lockdown on your own, it's basically that, right? So all these people live in a building together, but they never get to see each other. So some of them are catfish, some of them are not. Like It just it kind of unravels online. Let's go. Michelle Buto, where are you? The most brutal season yet. 100 G's. I can't remember how much they get over here in the UK. I think it's like 50k. If that. I don't even know if they get 50k. Pump up the jam. Oh yeah. Good tune. Nice start. Oh, okay, so Atlanta. Atlanta's the deep south. I get it. Social media game. Basically, if you've never seen it, you need to go and figure out how to best understand it. Oh, hello. Look at the chat keys. What's a chat key? Oh, she's quirky. I love her. Who's this then? Gavolt. Oi, Gavolt. Where have I heard that before? Is that Jewish? Is that Jewish? Oi, Gavolt. Hi, Deb. Oh, it's Deb and she's 54 able, she says. Oh. It's a teacher. So it'll be very informative. Oh, she's a dancer. She's a dancer. Oh, she's going to be a crier. She misses her hubby. She's going to be a crier. So she always hangs out on young people. Rich is coming in as a 26 year old. Now, this is a dangerous game because when older people try and be young online, it doesn't really work. They always trip themselves up. Okay. She's setting up her profile. So basically, they set their profiles up um, with a picture and they make up lies and stuff if they're catfishing. Oh she's, oh, she's quirky. She's got so much energy. I love this. Deb. I'm going to like Deb. I think I'm going to like Deb. Make that your profile picture. I agree with the profile picture, Deb. Good choice. And her 26-year-old alter ego, her catfish character, is cute. So I think she'll be getting a lot of guys in the DMs. Okay, who's next? Oh, it's a boy! He's young. How old is he? Who's Kevin? 23. From San Diego. So I'll tell you, he's going to be one of the... He's 23. Deb's catfish is 24. He'll be in her DMs. Oh, he's a party animal. He's a sales rep. Alcohol. No. <laughs> if you've seen this before, when they get drunk, they're hilarious on their own. He's going to lie. Oh, he's a liar. Good pictures. Oh my God. I wonder if he uses these pictures on his real profile. Oh, he's got some half naked pictures. He's got the thirst traps ready. Okay. He's going to play the game. Yes, okay. He's playing a game. Might be young, but I think he's going to be quite clever. Who next? Hello? Who's this? He looks like Martin Lawrence. Oh, no, he doesn't. It's Darien. He's got some muscles. Oh, we like some muscles, don't we? We love a bit of muscle. Oh, he's quirky as well. We like quirky people in the circle, especially when they have to spend so much time on their own. Oh, he's a fashionista. Oh, he's a teacher as well. We are going to come away from this season knowing so much about everything. I can just feel it in my bones. So he's single on his profile. I missed that. Did he say he's got a partner in real life? So I think he's being himself. He doesn't seem like he's playing a game. I like this. He helps underprivileged kids. Oh, he's a man after my heart. 
with his muscles. He's ready to win 100k! I think he's a bit of a game player then. It's for the kids. You'll do what he has to do for the kids. Oh, we've got a double whammy! The twins! Scorlata. Scorlatas? Sounds like an STI, Scorlatas. What? Oh no, they're from New York. I say that because in the first US season, there was somebody with their ac same accent as them and I just couldn't, I just couldn't concentrate. I'm walking here! Give me a coffee! It just went on and on and on. I know they're going to be talking together the whole time. Oh, they're like proper good fellas, I tell you. This is a kind of American that us over here, we just expect everyone to be like that. The taxi driver. <laughs> so their profile's Gianna then. He said it was somebody's girlfriend. I think it was one of the boys' girlfriend. Oh, they're cute though. They're a cute couple. They're not a couple, they're twins, but they're a cute couple of twins. Pair of twins. Couple of pairs? Pair of couple. Ignore it. Teacher. Two catfish. Lifeguard. Who's a lifeguard? Oh, they started with their first activity. Painting. Oh, no, that's just her. Circle chat's open. So basically, the first chat, they all go into like the DM in a group chat and they all get their notebooks together and they write notes about people and try and keep up and who's lying, who's not. Take me to circle chat. They're babies. Yes, Deb. Deb's like, everyone's so young in here. And she is literally the oldest one out of them all. So it's a good job she's picked a younger catfish because she might have been immediately ostracized she might have been like immediately thrown out of the clique first message everyone's always trying to be the best at the first message and we'd have circle friends you won't be friends in a week okay so rachel deb's character i was right Kevin is going straight in for her. I was right! Look at that smile. Oh, he's a bit of a dude. What's good, Circle Squad? I like them so far. I love all of them so far. Brilliant. Stoked is a Cali word. MD from California? Do you say stoked all the time? That was an Australian word. Now I think these guys, the twins, have picked the wrong angle. If they picked a guy to catfish, they would have been closer. But there's two guys. Trying to catfish by a, being a girl. And do you know what? Some of these guys, like Kevin, they just get so creepy. Like, men are creeps, right? And they're like, oh, look at those brown eyes. And they're always, they just go to the attraction immediately. I just, I hate it. So they're actually from Staten Island. Okay, that's good. They didn't lie. There's one thing you need to be good at in the circle when you're catfishing. It's lying. And I love the emojis. This is how I, as an old middle-aged man, keep up with my emoji game. This show, if it ever gets taken off the air, I'm screwed. They've got a good game. Creating a clique in that first chat. Good game. Everyone's like, party... Like, they're always like, I'm party person, let's get the party started. Party starts here. Mah, mah. Circle, party. Ah. He is cute, Deb. Yes, Darian is cute. With those muscles. I'll say it again. He's got muscles, in case you didn't hear me. 
<laughs> He's trying to make friends. He likes tequila. I sell tequila. We're perfect. We're just perfect. Yeah, they're all just keep talking about these parties. Like, okay, we need a bit older now. Come on, Michelle. Next player's coming in. Please be middle-aged. Let's give me somebody I can relate to. She's a kid. Hi, Heather. 26. I feel so old. I feel like Deb. Like, I think Deb is going to be like the closest one to me for for this season. Heather's a rock chick. I love her. Nice dimples. Look how cute her dimples are. So who's she? Oh, she's a catfish as well. She's catfishing as a guy. Oh, that's a shame. She would have been so popular. I think she would have been really popular. Andy. Look at him. Yeah. Oh, it's her ex. It's her ex. They must still be friends. There's no way she could have used his pictures without his permission. <laughs> this is hilarious. But she'll know him really well, though. She knows him well. And she's a burper. We've got a burper. Catfish Andy. I think Heather. I'm going to like Heather. Not sure about her character. Let's see how this goes. She's 20 something as well. Who's this? Jadiha, 24. They're all 20s. I did such a good job that Deb didn't be herself. Just for this, specifically. They're also bougie. She's bougie. Jadiha. Oh, she's so cute. And she loves a mimosa. Oh, she acts. She's intelligent. We've got intelligent girls in the house. They're going to think she's a catfish. Because of this. They're going to think it's all fake. Oh, she works out. She's a trainer. Not a trainer. She's a fitness buff, is what I meant. Definitely bougie. What's this guy's name with the muscles now? I forgot. It's not Kevin. Kevin's the other one. He'll be in her DMs straight away. Not Kevin. The black guy with the muscles. Savannah! Look at the bodysuit. She's cute, isn't she? 22. She must be a content creator. She's so funny. I hope she's clumsy in here. I love to watch people falling over. Oversharing is great for content. Oh my god, she's been through the ringer. Oh my god. But you know what? Like, when this happens, that car accident happened for a reason. Because it saved her life. Oh my god, that's really hot. That's a shame. Look at the cute dog. Look at doggy. They're all in and they're all babies. Like old people like me, this is how we keep up to date with what's going on online. Shows like this, with the twenties. I can't remember what it was like to be twenty. Oh, that's how old I am. I'm more than double that. Jesus. Hey y'all. Oh, so They've joined the chat. Let's see. They're party people as well. The party's here. If I remember rightly, we had more middle-aged people in the last season, so this must be why they've done this. Mixing it up a bit for the ratings. <laughs> Deb is like, oh, it's so filtered. These pictures are so filtered. My generation and above were just something else, I tell you. <laughs> Nobody believes that she works in tech. She's too young and pretty to work in tech. I don't know if she's got a sense of humour. That was very forced, Jahida. Jadiha. Oh, maybe it wasn't. She went to his profile. Oh, they're going to be hooking up online. She's so funny. I love her. Oh, they're using acronyms as well. This is where I get lost when the young people start using the acronyms. Who's Andy? Oh, of course, the catfish. Now she's catfishing a 34-year-old, so does that mean it's not all 20s? 
Like she was 20s, wasn't she? The twins are talking about flirting with the guy. Cut fishes, cut flirting with cut fishes. One of the best parts about this whole game when it gets to the end. When they start falling in love, then they realise they're not even real people. Lit AF. It means lit AF. I got that. Come on, Deb, keep up. Yeah, so Savannah is 22. Oh no, it's not Savannah, it's Catfish and Andy. Too many catfishes to start with. I'm getting so lost. Kevin hasn't sat down yet. I don't, I've not seen him sit down since he got into that apartment. He's been just sitting there, standing in front of the TV. <laughs> Kevin's like, completely misread. <laughs> teeny time, I've never heard of teeny time. <laughs> Middle-aged women drink espresso martinis. <laughs> well, I hate when that happens. They get so settled. Tell, talk, having a chat, trying to figure each other out, and then circle chat, closed. Go and pee, Deb. Go and pee. You can't think clearly when you're full of pee. Deurinate yourself. <laughs> Death Metal Diva. And they're unpacking the cases. Let's see what goodies you got. Because, I don't know, in the British one, they're only allowed to bring one thing. They've not covered that for a while. Oh, first game, risky question! Risky quizness? If you don't get it, risky business. Risky quizness? Let's go, let's go. Red thumb, green thumb. Can I play? Can I play? I'm playing. Would you send someone a nude photo? That's a red. I've never done it and I never will. Come on. Let's figure out who the real ones are. They're all quite young. I would expect young people to all just do it. Because it's a different generation, isn't it? I'm sorry, Mom. Deb's got to sit. Deb said yes, she's 56. Oh, she's doing it as the younger girl, okay. Oh, most people said yes. Only one said no. Wow. She's ostracized herself. Would you join the Mile High Club? I've never been in the Mile High Club. I'm going to say yes, I would. Yes, I would. Because I can't die before I do, maybe. If you don't know what the Mile High Club is, go and Google it. We're doing social media, obviously, so go and Google it. And the planes I take, there's not enough room. <laughs> Jadeha doesn't do anything. She's like, no. I think she's going to ostracize herself again. She did. She was the only one that said no. Oh... Uh, I think she's making a wall for herself here. She needs to start lying. Because they're all the same age. She doesn't understand they're all the same age. She's like, you all need Jesus. Would you jump in an icy lake? To I'd, s I'd jump into anything to save a dog. That is a yes. Yes. <laughs> Kevin, so funny. If anybody says no, they're getting evicted immediately. Darian said, no, he can't swim. That means he doesn't love dogs. That means he doesn't love dogs. He has... Yeah, you're in trouble, mate. You're in trouble. Exactly, what type of person says no? You can only be friends with people who save the dogs. Would you read texts on your partner's phone? If you'd asked me 10 years ago, it would have been a green. But I'm a bit more grown now. I couldn't care less. <laughs> That's a red for me. Oh no. This is going to be a hard green thumb for most of these people. Kevin says no. Deb says no. Even as a young person. Darian said yes. Does that mean most of them said no? Darian's the only one who said yes. So... He doesn't like dogs, and he doesn't trust anyone. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Everyone just, everyone's going to be voting against him now. 
That was it. That was it. Four questions. That's enough. To be honest, that is enough to get the wrong viewpoint of you if you're not careful. Darian. Americans go Darian. Darian? Darian. Darian. Darian? Darian. Darian. I love Michelle. She just makes everything so okay in the end when she comes in and gives a little bit. So Jojo and Nikki, that's the twins. Right, okay. Yeah. The Staten Island crew. Well, she must have the menopause. She's sweating. She's menopausal. They're sussing her out. They're trying to figure out if she's lying or not. She's doing good at playing like a younger person. Oh, they're just trying to catch her out and she didn't fall for it because she's not lying. They're so animated. But you know, the last, the guy I was talking about earlier, who's from, who was from New York, and his voice just bugged me. I was like, he was animated as well. Like, really animated. Deb's so cute. I love Deb. And she looks so comfortable. Cozied up under the cover with her sh a sweater on. Sweater weather. So, so much energy. I love this. Oh, man. Oh, man. Come on, Rachel. Message. She's good for the acronyms. GTFO. Super Circle Squad. I think they found their first alliance. They've been in a couple of hours and they're like, after this, we're going clubbing. I'm dead. I'm dead. We found their strongest alliance. Right. First day. Day one. Day one. They've rushed it. They've rushed it. They'll be out too soon. Maybe it's because they're all from the same area. They're just so over it. <laughs> Hashtag Rihanna. No, that name's taken. Staten Island. I think I've been to Staten Island. Oh no, I haven't. No, I haven't. This is not what I thought was going to happen. I thought Darian was going to go straight into Jahan Jahanna's DMs, but he's created a group chat. He's trying to redeem himself now, look. They just think that's an excuse though about saving these dogs. It's not, he's, he's telling the truth. But he shouldn't need to cover his back, like. I thought he was more intelligent than that. They're so funny. Young people are just so different in DMs, like. I think it is, like they're all kind of in this chat and it just seems like they're all covering their back somehow. Like if I was in the other room, I'd, I'd just think everyone was lying until proven otherwise. And they're all just slagging Jade chat and she, she's just like, you all need Jesus. 34, he's 34 and he's the grandfather of the group. Are you joking me? How old am I? This is really upsetting. <laughs> You're all making me just feel so old. I don't think I can carry on with this whole reaction thing. You've all upset me so much. Send message. Circle, type message. You're all making me feel so old. Circle, send message. First night, I wonder what game they're getting. They're all playing dominoes. How do you know, I, I would just get so bored. I love my own space, but with that little to do, surely you must get so bored. It's bonkers. Alert! Oh my God, I told you. An event's coming, an activity's coming, a party's coming. It's a rating on the first day. Oh no. Oh no. Shit is about to get real. You're not wrong. So, top two players become influencers. The influencers get to decide who.
who gets evicted from the circle. That's your update. Let's go. Anything can happen. It's the first fucking day. They don't know each other. And this is the worst thing about when you start a show. Like, you get... You don't have enough time to figure out who you like, but you might really like one person in the first half an hour like this, and then they're gone? It's an emotional journey. It's just like, I'm an emotional wreck. Yeah, Gianna's in first place because they're from the same place. Alliance. Hashtag alliance. Yeah. Oh no. That's not Debs. So Deb gave them first and they just didn't give her? You're burning bridges. They're all burning bridges. They're not going for the people they should be going for. I hate this. Yeah. Jadeja is in danger. <laughs> You're trying to evict somebody because they're drinking an espresso martini in their 20s. The younger generation are something else, I tell you. Kevin was full of energy when this started, but when he got in, he was energetic. Ratings complete, but now he did nothing but stand in front of that screen for the whole thing. He didn't get excited, he didn't get annoyed, he didn't get upset. He just stood there like this and just spoke. Does that mean me? Does that mean I'm born? Deb's tired. Go to bed, love. Get a rest. You've got a big day ahead tomorrow if you don't get thrown out for drinking espresso martinis. Okay, are we in the next day? Because she's wearing the same top. Or is this after? Oh no, we're still in the evening. She's had a nap. And she's talking with Savannah. Where's the dog? Oh, I've oh not seen the dog for a while. You put her last place. She wants to be friends and you're trying to get rid of her for drinking espresso martinis. So ageist. Like, when you see the difference in ages, like, you can really see how ageist younger people are. And it makes me wonder, were we like that when we were younger? And this is exactly what you wanted. Well, it's a bit too late, Savannah. She still drinks espresso martinis. These parts of the show really get me. Because everyone's got a story. And do you know what? I don't know if I'll be getting as upset when I'm reacting, but in all these other series, seasons, when I'm on the sofa watching, it's like, probably when I relax into it, my emotions will kick in, but I do get really emotional with this show. With me. Like with Deb, now. He's a part of me. I'd be in bits. I'm an emotional wreck anyway, to be honest. Deb's Those so sweet. Okay, Rachel, Deb's so upset. I really do. I think I've gotten... Keep forgetting Deb's playing a different character. Rachel. This is where I get lost. I forget who's who. I mean, there's more catfish than real people. It's so confusing. For me. Because I'm old. Circle, send. Maybe. Maybe Rachel. Maybe Savannah is meant to marry one of your boys. Alert! They can't throw somebody out already. The results are in. Episode one. Episode one. You're right. When influencers are influencers at the start, they usually drop off quite early. The influencers then choose one player to block. Okay. I'm nervous. Drum roll, ladies and gentlemen. Seventh place. I think it's going to be Deb. Rachel. It's Gianna. Yeah, you were their number one. She was your number one, but that was it. Now everyone's like, but why are they in last place? What did they? What happened behind the scenes that put them in last place? Then it gets everyone anxious. And you have to work double as hard to stay in the game. 
Oh, they're oh, they've got an American temper, a New York temper. Rachel six. She's the only one that relates to me. <laughs> Don't cry, Deb. Gutted. Really wanted Rachel to stay in. Fifth. How is he fifth? Fourth, Kevin. He, he's been he's been in all the chats. I can get that, and I can get if you've been in all the chats, that's why you're going to end up further further up. So who's third? It'll be Savannah. I think Savannah's third. No, Janaja, Jadeja. What? They're both blondies. I know one's a catfish, but they're both blondies. These are the two. These are I've been, all episode. I've been getting confused about which one's which. I don't know faces. I can't remember faces. I, it's not a medical diagnosis. I just, I'm stupid. Who is it? She did play it well. Death Metal Girl. Adam is a catfish name. I'm buffering. I'm buffering. Why is this happening in the circle? Uh oh. Oh, she's crying. Savannah is so happy. So much energy. You've got the influencers with me. They are on fire. You're right, Savannah. You are on fire. You played a good game. And I hate you all for putting Deb last. Second last. What actually just happened? Literally just getting started. Alert! Woo! Are the influencers are deciding now? I don't even need to wait till the next episode. Yeah. Can we all just be one big happy family in the circle? No, never, not allowed, out. Message, send. They all ranked you so low. You were last. They all ranked you so low. <laughs> you didn't make that much of an impact, I'm afraid. Bye. I love the hideout. It's all geometric this time. Got all the geometry in it. I like it when they go in the hideout as a date and they've got like a little date together. I love that. Okay, right, so what are the options? First message together. Oh, they've said it, my fellow blondie. I said it first. Oh, obviously because Andy's a blondie as well. Yeah. I keep forgetting. I keep forgetting. I feel like there's more for me to learn about all of you. I can't evict anyone tonight, please. Don't do this to me. Never mind the rest of your apartment people in the circle. I'm all about it. All about it. Praise Jesus. Okay. <laughs> So she wants to save Dorian. She wants to save Kevin. Oh, she's Greek. Maybe she's not Greek. Is that what sorority is? Is that a Greek thing? We don't get that here. Oh, they've got a surprise as well. Insider secret in the UK one, apparently... They do these evictions at like two or three in the morning, maybe four in the morning when they're really tired and they like can't co think coherently because it makes for better dis like better drama. Apparently, I don't know how true that is. Does anyone know? Drop me a comment. And ever since I found that out, I always think they just look really tired during this pit. Oh, they're doing a game. What are they doing? Being the destructor might give you an advantage or disadvantage. So one person will become the dis disruptor. So how do they decide who the disruptor is? I missed that. Oh, the twins are angry. They're anxious. So they have to initiate disruptor mode or not. Oh, please do it. Please do it. Please do it, please do it, please do it. I think if they have voted yes to disruptor mode, they get put into a different apartment instead of evicted. If they vote no to disruptor mode, I think 
they will actually just be evicted. Let's see if that happens. Ooh, Dev said no. I'm not doing that. Darian said I'm no. I'm not doing it. I think they have to do it. Jadeha said no. I'm not doing it. Twins said yes. Very energetically. And the, what's Kevin doing? What did Kevin do? They've not told me. We don't know what's gonna happen right now. You've not told me what Kevin's doing. I've heard one yes. No! You can't end like that. Ah! Absolutely fuming. How can you wait? Who's evicted? Who's a disruptor? Is there a disruptor? This. This is why I watch. I hate things like this, but I fucking watch it. Leave me a comment down below. What do you think is going to happen next? I'm anxious. I'm nervous. Who knows? Who knows what's going to happen? Tune back in for the next one then, guys. Don't forget to subscribe. Drop me a comment down below. Let me know what you think is going to happen. And I will speak to you next time. Take care, guys. Bye. Pow!